upgrades. <laughs> Two hours detention. Who's the clever boy now? Hmm? Young fellow? <laughs> Don't move, or I'll like huh? Sally, do we? Just who I was looking for. Could you investigate a missing animal? Hmm. Oh, it's terrible. Paco has disappeared. Paco? Yeah, he's Mr. Shoebridge's parrot. He must have flown out through the open window. <laughs> nice doggy. Good boy. Okay, okay, no need to growl at me. What was the state of the office last night? Exactly as it is. Nobody's touched a thing. I don't understand. I always close the doors and windows. Always. Sally, look at this. What kind of bird bothers to close the cage door behind it when it escapes? Really? What can that mean? That means that somebody either released or took away your bird. Why? He was a sweet parrot who, who simply spent all day mimicking me and chatting happily in his cage. Do you have a photo of him? Hmm. Can you do anything? Can you find Paco? We'll do our best. One final thing. <gasps> Has anybody contacted you recently? What do you mean? If it's a kidnapping, the kidnapper may contact you for a ransom. I'll stay close to the phone. I have a meeting with Bob, but keep me up to date with developments in the investigation. Ah, yes, Bob. Now, according to my computer, your grades have gone into freefall. This disappearance is really strange. Why steal a parrot? I don't know, but we have to act quickly. The longer time goes on, the wider the search area becomes. Hey, this is new. What is it? This is a poster from the Return Animals to Nature Front. Have you ever heard of them, Dewey? No, but I have the feeling we should find out some more. Hey, you! What have you done for animals today, huh? <laughs> According to their website, it's an old school club that has expanded recently under Bridget Brickhouse's leadership. And there's no time to infiltrate the club. On, How can we there. find out what they're up to? Here they come! We'll use my new surveillance microphone shooter. It's my latest invention, and it can shoot surveillance microphones. <gasps> hey, get away, beat it, bird. You're in my way. Off, off, off. Ow. Animals really don't like me, do they? Quick, Dewey, the mic. <gasps> Nice job, Dewey. Headphones! You can be proud of yourselves, girls. Yesterday's operation was a great success. Everybody's talking about it in the yard. Free the hamsters! Free the hamsters! The hamsters can wait. Tonight I've planned something else. Putting animals in cages is over. Free the hamsters. Free the hamsters. <sighs> We've heard enough. It's time for action. Free the hamsters! Free the FBI, hamsters! FBI, nobody move. Run for it, girls, and carry on the struggle. Stop them, Dewey. Why did you do it? To get the cause known. Shutting animals in cages is too cruel. Yeah, free the hamsters, right? And is that why you released the principal's parrot? What parrot? I thought you were talking about our demonstration at the local pet shop last night. See? That's me there, and you can see the horrible pet shop manager. He doesn't like animals, that's for sure. But is that all you did yesterday? A demo outside the pet shop? Yes. We're just trying to create public awareness, not release any animals. Oh! This sign indicates the shop sells exotic birds! Like the principal's parrot. The thief could probably get a good price for Paco in this shop. Hello? Anyone there? Psh! I'm here! I'm here! 
You don't have to shout. Oh, you're not with yesterday's rowdy crowd, are you? Uh, no. I'm looking for a pet, and I was wondering if a bird... Oh, I see. Yes, well, follow me. I've got what you want. I bet he's going to offer me the principal's parrot. You're in luck. I've got plenty of birds just now. very much. I don't see Shoebridge's bird in that cage. You wouldn't be selling a bird like this one by any chance. Oh no, never. Parrots are the noisiest of the lot. Now I like silence. That's why I'm branching out in the exotic fish trade. Time's flying and we still don't have any leads. Yes, and I don't see how we can flush out the thief unless he shows himself. You're right. We'll check if he's contacted Mr. Shoebridge. So, any news from the kidnapper? No, no phone call, nothing. What about email? Yes, good point. I haven't checked my email for some time. Open Sesame! <gasps> hmm. <laughs> what did you just do then? Oh, impressive, isn't it? It's my new security system. It uses voice recognition. Can I try too? Uh, why not? Open Sesame! <laughs> it uses voice recognition. You don't just need the password, you must have my voice too to make it work. Your voice? That's it! Dewey, hurry, we've got a lead. So, but, but, what about my emails? Who could know that the principal had a parrot and a computer with voice recognition? A few teachers, maybe? The caretaker? And a student who spends a lot of time in the principal's office. And who would like to access the computer in order to change his grades. Ah, yes, Bob. Now, according to my computer, your grades have gone into free fall. A student like Bob! Exactly. And there he is. He could be going for the bird. The bag. It's birdseed. Huh? Oh, we have got him. Free the hamsters. Rats, we've lost him. Don't worry, Sally. We'll follow his trail. Ah, so that's what the mic was for. To make a hole in the bag. Nice work, Dewey. This way. Oh, come on, Parco. Say the password and I'll give you a load of seed. More homework. You're going to be in trouble, Bob. You need better grade. Write 100 lines. Oh, this is top quality seed, Parco. Say the principal's password into the nice dictaphone and you can have a ton. Oh, birdie num num. Give us the bird, <sighs> Bob. You're caught like a rat in a trap. Go eat seed, creep. <laughs> I'll take care of Bob. You look after the bird. <gasps> stop, Bob! Uh, I wasn't expecting you to really stop, but okay. Ah, right. Now I understand. Bob, this way. <gasps> Do you mind telling me what you were doing in the basement? Oh, I hope you're pleased with yourself. Quite pleased, yes. What's more, Dewey is going to catch the parrot and... <gasps> Dewey! Animals don't like him! Pretty, pretty Paco. Pretty, pretty... <coughs> right, listen. Paco, you probably don't like me, but if you choose to come with me, I'll take you home to your master. Oh, 
little Sally and Dewey. You cannot imagine how happy I am to have Paco back. I can never thank you enough. And as for you, Bob, you will be on cage cleaning duty till the end of the year. Oh, no! Oh, and uh, Dewey, Paco wanted to tell you something. Is that true? What? Dewey, Paco's friend. Huh? What? Dewey, animal friend. What? Did you hear that? Did you hear that? He likes me! Ah! To make a hole in the bag. Nice work, Dewey. This way. Say the password and I'll give you a load of seed. More homework. You're going to be in trouble, Bob. You need better grade. Write 100 lines. Oh, this is top quality seed, Paco. Say the principal's password into the nice dictaphone and you can have a ton. Oh, birdie num num. Give us the bird, Bob. You're caught like a rat in a trap. Go eat seed, creep. <laughs> I'll take care of Bob. You look after the bird. expecting you to really stop, but okay. Ah, right. Now I understand. Bob, this way. Do you mind telling me what you were doing in the basement? Oh, I hope you're pleased with yourself. Quite pleased, yes. What's more, Dewey is going to catch the parrot and... <gasps> Dewey! Animals don't like him! Pretty hamsters! The hamsters can wait. Tonight I've planned something else. Putting animals in cages is over. Free the hamsters. Free the hamsters. Oh, we've heard enough. It's time for action. Free the hamsters! Free the FBI. hamsters! FBI! Nobody move! Run for it, girls! And carry on the struggle! Stop them, Dewey! you do it? To get the cause known. Shutting animals in cages is too cruel. Yeah, free the hamsters, right? And is that why you released the principal's parrot? What parrot? I thought you were talking about our demonstration at the local pet shop last night. See? That's me there, and you can see the horrible pet shop manager. He doesn't like animals, that's for sure. But is that all you did yesterday? A demo outside the pet shop? Yes. We're just trying to create public awareness, not release any animals. Oh! This sign indicates the shop sells exotic birds! Like the principal's parrot. The thief could probably get a good price for Paco in this shop. Hello? Anyone there? Shh! I'm here! I'm here! You don't have to shout! Oh, you're not with the yesterday's... Him. Don't worry, Sally. We'll follow his trail. Ah, so that's what the mic was for. To make a hole in the bag. Nice work, Dewey. This way. <gasps> Do more homework. Shh. Ah, two hours detention. Oh, come on, Paco. Say the password and I'll give you a load of seed. More homework. You're going to be in trouble, Bob. You need better grade. Write 100 lines. Oh, this is top quality seed, Paco. Say the principal's password into the nice dictaphone and you can have a ton. Oh, birdie num nums. Give us the bird, Bob. You're caught like a rat in a trap. 
No ain't seen, creep. <laughs> I'll take care of Bob. You look after the bird. Stop! Ah, so that's what the mic was for. To make a hole in the bag. Nice work, Dewey. This way. Oh, come on, Parco. Say the password and I'll give you a load of seed. More homework. You're going to be in trouble, Bob. You need better grades. Write 100 lines. Oh, this is top quality seed, Parco. Say the principal's password into the nice dictaphone and you can have a ton. Oh, birdie num num. Give us the bird, Bob. You're caught like a rat in a trap. Go ain't seed, creep. <laughs> I'll take care of Bob. You look after the bird. Stop, Bob! Uh, I wasn't expecting you to really stop, but okay. Ah, right. Now I understand. Bob, this way! Do you mind telling me what you were doing in the basement? I hope you're pleased with yourself. Quite pleased, yes. What's more, Dewey is going to catch the parrot and... 